Hello, hello, my beautiful, beautiful earth signs. I'm Arielle and this is Maven Unmasked with your winter tarot scopes for the winter season of 2017 through 2018. Um, so again, this is the reading for Tor Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn, um, sun, moon, or ascendant. Please be sure to check out the other videos um, for your sun, uh, moon or ascendant sign if you are an earth sun. Um, quick announcement, I do have some holiday happenings going on um, in the mavenummasks.com website shop. Um, I do have two New Year's readings, so holiday readings are up for a a 12 month outlook into the year ahead, my year ahead reading. You will also get an angel, god, or goddess to guide you all year, um, a spirit animal, as well as a crystal. If you're more interested into my spark your year reading, um, which is a seven card reading with seven major focus areas for your year ahead, um, you will also get a personally channeled message from spirit for you, an affirmation for you to use all year long. Okay. Um, this is a general reading for earth signs on the mavenummass.com blog. I will have an oracle card, particularly um, for your sign, whether it be Taurus, um, Virgo, or Capricorn, you'll each get an individual oracle card um, for your winter tarot scope. Um, the tarot deck I will be using today is the Spirit Song Tarot. So loving this deck, really excited to work with it. Alrighty, so I'm gonna take a moment. We're gonna shuffle these cards and I'm just going to call in your angels, your guides, your ancestors, your loved ones and spirit of those born under an earth, sun, moon, <laughs> or ascendant. What is the energy surrounding you this winter season? Okay, we've got some. Okay. Alrighty, so there's four. Alrighty, so our shadow card here is the Five of Crystals, okay? The Five of Crystals, so we may be worried about some money stuff, some finances, feeling safe and secure at home, um, but the key words on this card are persistence and new possibilities. So even though um, things may not seem as bright as they once were, to keep moving forward, to keep being persistent because new doors are just waiting to be opened, okay? So to just keep moving forward, the ladybug is here um, with the sign of luck and support for you, my beautiful earth signs. So our first card we have here is the page of crystals ideas and discipline so um maybe thinking of new ideas um for for resources um and also being mindful i want to say if there's any contracts you're thinking about signing or any people you're thinking about going into work with or business with partnership friends anything of that um kind of nature um to just be mindful of illusions to be careful that you're seeing the bigger picture the whole entire truth um you know, just, just to be mindful and know that sometimes with some things, it's okay to do it alone. Okay. Um, but be mindful of who you invest your energy into and who you trust, who you share your ideas with. Um, I also feel that it's you're going to need to be really, really disciplined in getting your ideas and whatever it is um, that you're trying to procreate to take um, root and to spring forth. But we also have the page of feathers. So very, very interesting. We've got two new beginnings, two new um, deepenings of action happening here. With the page of feathers, we have exploration and discovery. Okay. So really explore the new possibilities um, that are coming up for you. Be persistent because they're coming. But again, with the fox and with the raccoon, both next to each other, I want to say be mindful of any trickster energy, okay? Any trickster energy, any thievery, any people wearing masks or not um, being exactly who they present themselves um, to be, my darling earth signs, okay? But don't let that um, stop you from continuing to explore and discover and take things further, okay? Our next card here is the King of Acorns, optimism and innovation, okay? So keep persisting to that optimism and that innovation. That's really, really what's coming through um, for a lot of the other um, or, uh Zodiac sign readings as well. Keep pursuing to take um, um, that leap of faith and to go for your goals and what you want and something new. Um, stay positive, okay? Again, innovate, new ideas, be disciplined with it, continue to explore and discover so that you can 
find new possibilities and a new way out of any grief or struggles that you may find yourself in. But with the Eight of Acorns, know that it's going to take a lot of hard work and a lot of energy, okay? A lot of that fuel, a lot of that spark is going to be required to get the results that you are looking for. Four, okay? Keep your mind sharp, I also want to say with this as well, okay? Keep that energy flowing. Make sure you're keeping your spiritual um, energy good and protected and shielded um, and replenished because you're, I feel you're, like you're going to have to really, really give a lot this winter to get where you want to go. But again, I'm Arielle and this has been Maven Unmasked with your winter 2017 to 2018 tarot scopes. Again, this is a general reading. So if you would like a more personal reading with me tailored to you and your situation, you can do so over at my website, mavenonmass.com, under the book of readings tab. Alrighty. Have a great winter, lovelies. Bye.